Former Beach Grove teacher's aide appeared in court this afternoon to plead guilty to public indecency. Michael Lazell admitted to fondling himself while working at Beach Grove Middle School. WRTV Investigates has been tracking this case and our Kara Kenny joins us with what happened in court. We do want to warn you, some may find the following content disturbing to watch. The case against Michael Lazell has been going on for nearly three years here in Marion County Criminal Division 18. Today, it took one step closer to resolution. It was January 25th, 2019 at Beach Grove Middle School. According to court records, two female students, one of them 13 years old, told their counselors that teacher's aide Michael Lazell masturbated in front of them in math class while watching his school-issued computer. Beach Grove police investigated and found soft porn had been accessed at the time the girls said Lazell had been touching himself. Beach Grove City Schools told Lazell they no longer needed his services and he was removed from school property. Days later on February 4th, 2019, prosecutors charged Lazell with performing sexual conduct in the presence of a minor, a felony, as well as public indecency, a misdemeanor. Fast forward nearly three years later, Lazell appeared in court Wednesday with his attorney to plead guilty to public indecency. He told the judge he fondled his own genitals in a school. As part of the plea, prosecutors dismissed the felony charge. Uh, Mr. Lazell, do you plan on uh, teaching after this? After court, Lazell and his attorney again avoided our camera and questions. Beach Grove City Schools says Lazell worked for a staffing company that contracts with Beach Grove. Michael Lazell's substitute teaching permit expired. The Indiana Department of Education says it is monitoring the criminal case against Lazell. The judge accepted this plea agreement and sentenced Lazell to a year of probation and a $100 fine. But the judge says no amount of money can account for the harm done to the children who had to witness Lazell's misconduct. Working for you, Kara Kenny, WRTV. As part of the plea, Lazell must undergo a psychosexual evaluation. He must pay $625 total in fines, court costs, as well as probation fees. WRTV investigates asked the Indiana Department of Education if Lazell can renew his teaching license in the, in the future, even with a conviction for public indecency, and we are still waiting to hear back.